This tutorial will be how to make a slip knot right handed. Making a slip knot is really easy. To make a slip knot in my hands, and you can make it on the crochet hook or the knitting needle as well, if you'd like to see that go ahead and um, leave comments and I'll do it, but I've just always made them in my hands because it's just as easy. So in order to do it more predominantly right handed, what I do is I hold the yarn between my thumb and my index finger. I have the short end on top and the long end attached to the skein on the bottom. I'll go ahead and pull on the short end, grab the bottom, you see how it crosses, and then I'll just take my index and middle finger of my right hand and pull the long end through the loop. Now this creates the slip knot. You know you've done it right if you can pull the knot right out. So let's do this again. We have the short end on top and the long end on bottom. I grab the short end, put it over the long end, grab with my middle and index finger and pull it through. It creates a loop that can be pulled right out. Now it's important that the long end is the one that comes through to create the loop. The reason that we want the long end doing that is because we want the long end controlling the tension and not the short end. So here we go. So what ends up happening is that the long end is what creates the tension when you start crocheting. If you do it with the short end, what ends up happening is especially in little rings. Let me see if I can go ahead and... So there we go. Sorry about it being kind of fuzzy. When we do flowers, sometimes you'll join a chain. You'll join a chain to make a loop. Now sometimes they have you join with a slip stitch, which is going in and pulling the yarn straight through both, and it's connected. If you were to actually be making that slip knot with the short end, what will happen is that loop will get really, really big. So it's just better to have the long end be the tension so you won't have the bottom stitch come undone. So what we'll do is we'll just pull this completely out. And here we go again. The short end over the long end. Grab your fingers and pull through. Okay. Thank you so much for watching.